I'm Laura McGrath, and I am a nurse practitioner at Core Primary Care. I'm Erin Carding. I'm a nurse practitioner for Same Day Access. I think for me, you know, a lot of the reward has been getting to collaborate with the Same Day Access group and other providers, I think. As nurses, that's like one of our strong points is that we've always worked with different members of the care team, whether that's physicians, other nurses, medical assistants, providers. Um, and so as a PCP, I'm often doing that with specialists. I'm doing that with you guys. Um, and it's just really great to know that we can try to keep patients in our system where they're best known. And I think that that really um, provides some of the best quality care. And I think one of the strong suits about having same-day access as a part of the core primary network is that even though we're seeing people for those acute medical needs, we can still be in touch with their primary care providers Absolutely. if needed. We can still be in touch with all of their core specialists very easily if needed, yeah. which really keeps their care you know, close to core, and it keeps us being able to take care of people more effectively. Absolutely. One of the great aspects of core primary care is that we have access to 20 specialties uh, in our network over at the hospital um, and other local satellite offices that we're affiliated with. Um, and it's been quite a pleasure and privilege to work with a lot of those providers. Um, it's really nice that we can have communication with them. And so just knowing that it can be hard for patients to get in with specialists and um, communicate with them. And so we may be able to help facilitate that sometimes if there's a concern and perhaps, um, you know, we need to coordinate with them a little bit better. So that's one um, really nice piece that we have for patients. Primary care has been in a point of transformation recently. Um, there's been a lot of reasons for this, but um, nurse practitioners recently at CORE in the last couple of years have become primary care providers, also known as PCPs. Um, and so there's, like I said, lots of reasons why this happened. One of the main drivers uh, for this change was really access for patients. Um, there's been a really big shortage of providers that can accept new patients in the area. Um, and this has been a problem in New Hampshire and really across the United States. Um, and so one of the ways that we looked at was, you know, can we expand the availability for patients? Um, and so for me, this was a pretty natural transition. Um, I was already taking care of a lot of these patients for many years. I've been here for six years now. And so I had those relationships already with patients. Um, and so for me, it was a pretty natural progression of that. Um, and I was able to take a little bit more ownership of my practice um, and sort of feel great that I'm serving a need in the community. So it's been quite rewarding. Whether you have a nurse practitioner or physician as your primary care provider, uh, you may see a variety of types of providers. It might be a nurse practitioner, a physician, or a physician assistant. And the goal is really just to get you the care that you need as efficiently as we can. So I think one of the challenges that patients are facing is the complexity of the healthcare system lately and you know how do you access it and how quickly you can get in. And many times you might need a referral from a primary care to even get in to see a specialist and the length of time to see, you know, get established as a new patient can be quite long sometimes. And so we looked at primary care, how do we transform that and improve that for patients? And so um, I think we've created a few new things recently that have helped patients quite immensely in terms of accessing care. And so one of those is a virtual new patient provider, as well as our same day access team. Hi, I'm Sandra. I'm a nurse practitioner here at Core Physicians and part of the primary care new patient welcome team. When you're looking for a new primary care provider and you give our office a phone call, you'll be greeted by a member of our new patient welcome team. During that phone call, this person will assist you with finding a primary care provider that is convenient to you and also helping to, um, to schedule that first visit. If you have any acute health problems or if you need medication refills um, or need uh, referrals, to a specialist, you can see me for an initial telehealth visit. I'm available to see you as early as the same day that you call in for that appointment, even if we don't have all your records available. So during that visit, I'll work with you to go through your medical history and set up your chart for your primary care provider, and then we'll go ahead and also address the concerns that you had of that day. And then following up after that, we'll set you up with your primary care or somebody on their team. 
The same day access program was created to try to really provide that access to care within the core primary network. We obviously know it's best to see your PCP. They know your medical history best and they know you best. But at times when your PCP is not available or any other provider in their office is not available, the same day access team is here to see you. Obviously, we know not everybody gets sick between the hours of 8 and 5, which is why we wanted to create hours that started a little bit before that, a little bit after that, and we also have weekend hours available for you. Please always try to call CORE first, because we are more than happy to see you. CORE Primary Care has offices from Portsmouth to Plasto. If you go on our website, you can find out where the locations of those offices are, as well as any primary care providers that are taking any new patients.